if you guys aren't aware, every single day there are multiple Sonics ran tournaments in game. Uh, I think it's at like 3, 6, 9, and 12, something like that. I don't know if the 3 o'clock one is a thing or if I'm making that up, but you can see right here, 6, 9, and 12 is definitely a thing. Um, but yeah, we definitely uh, are going to be playing this one right now, that's what I know for sure. And we're going to be trying to get a dub here. So we're going to get into it, we're probably going to have a random team, I'm pretty sure. Uh, unless Musty gets someone before it starts, but uh, yeah, let's get into it. Let's even get some dubs. Let's see how it goes. All right, we ended up picking up one to Mike for our tournament for today. We're playing against uh, Blossom, Vibe, and Lobster for first match here. Musty named our team Musty One to Squish. All right, playing Lobster Goaded. Sign, you're my daddy. Hi, I love you, Squishy. I will give him a heart. All right, see how this goes. First round, I'll show you guys the bracket after this. See what it's looking like. I'm using some different settings right now. I've used these in past video not too long ago. Experimenting a little bit. They look like they have potential. I'm trying to, oh my, what a shot. I'm trying the close settings right now. I'm on the close settings wave. Looks nice, man, it feels nice. Just takes a bit to get used to. And I'm not someone who gives it time. Has to feel good right away or I don't like it. Wait for Musty. Clean. Where I get start. So flip reset from one that I could pass. You hit out the back wall there. Musty is probably trying to shoot, for being honest. But is a good enough shot that ended up being a perfect pass to me. Honestly, those are the best passes, those ones that are just near misses on shots. Often the best ones. Pass from Musty. Should have been a goal for me. That's fine. Took a little bit of a rushed approach at the final touch there. Good challenge from Musty. Good finish as well. Settings feel really nice though. The right amount of close, not too close, and the right amount of stiff and not too stiff. I don't know how to explain it. It's like a slightly modified version of what I made in uh, a previous video where I messed with my settings a bit. The other close settings I was using. Good touch from Musty. Thought one would have that, so I'm a little bit delayed. I ended up lagging at the worst time as well. That's so unfortunate. Alright, everyone's server. The whole server just died for everyone at the same time. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, when I pressed the uh, scoreboard there, everyone's pings was flashing. I didn't let me flip on that one. The first flip attempt back. I was trying to pinch that off the ground in the net. Would have been crazy. Would have been absolutely insane if I got that. Big boost deal. Gonna have nothing to, to get back to that. Even if he did have boost, really well placed shot for Musty. But yeah. Not only did I get in his way there, but I also took his boost. He's on zero boost trying to defend the shot that's placed perfectly in the top corner, right? It's a very tough thing to stop. Diamond 3. No way he's Diamond 3. He's an SSL attorney. He's actually Diamond 3. That's crazy. I don't think so, though. Surely he's joking. Very tough spot to be in from uh, Wanda there. If you're ever in this position and they have the ball like that, the best thing you can do is try to play the low play. Force them high if you absolutely have to, but when you pre-jump high like that, it gives them a lot of options low. And most good players would have went high there, that's why Wanda did block high. Not that that guy's a bad player, but most high level players would have went high. Not a bad thing at all to expect. Try to pass to Wanda there. Instead of going for a shot. Yeah, most of the time blocking the low on a dribble like that is much better. Most of the time. Just air dreaming alone here. Pick it up the wall. I'll take my time on this. Got it around two. It's going to be free goal. Played for Musty to be there. So I get this right side for a Wanda. I always try to get the kick off to your teammates if you can. So you do that by going the opposite side of where you want the ball to go. Most of the time it'll force it. It's not too difficult. It might look more difficult than it is, but it's not that hard. 
Takes a little bit of practice and you'll be able to get it almost every time. I can pretty much control like which side it goes to if I want it to go back left, back right. How far forward it goes. I can control all that stuff at this point because I've been doing it for so long. Competitive threes like with my actual team. I do it every single time. I try to control where the, the ball goes on kickoff. Wait for the bounce here. Play around one. Must be untouched probably. Gotta put patient on this ball. One that also went, so I can't actually go for a shot there. I have to play patient on that. Because if it goes badly, it's not going to be uh, very good for us, right? If I just rush that, they get a save off the back wall or something. It's going to be a really bad situation for us. All stuck on their half. Things feel very simple on these settings, but nothing looks like super cool, if that makes sense. Like the cool looking stuff doesn't look so cool in these settings. It's hard to explain. We gotta stop scoring, man. In too many goals. While I'm recording this, by the way, guys, I've been up for over 20 hours now. So I can feel my body shutting down as we speak. So forgive me if uh, I sound weird or like I'm stuttering or tired ish. Try my best. My eyes are slowly closing, but I'm trying. He's gonna bait for one there. Place off the wall. Must he should have. Can actually get a touch on that is really tough. Hard for Musty to get past me there, so I don't I don't blame him for hitting that behind me. Just a hard ball to get out of with a good pass. Play off the wall. So I get their boost here. I'm gonna wait on it. It's gonna come to me in a second, I believe. I can see the future. One more. Then Musty hits this. Hold on. I still see the future. Musty goes in a second here. It's gonna get over him, but then one is gonna get a touch. And then Musty. And then I wait again. And then I wait again. And then I wait again. And then I go. And then Wanda is going to pass to me pre-jumping off the ceiling. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, maybe the future that I see is uh, incorrect. It's a glitch. I'm glitching my psychic ability. Definitely, it could have happened. There, there was a world where it was possible. A different timeline, maybe. It was a crazy kickoff shot. Doesn't have that. Wait, musty to me? Ah, close, close. That'd have been crazy, actually. Anglo is coming at that. Oh my. We almost have 10 goals. What's happening? Good pass back there. Yeah, we're going crazy. Oh, let's go for 10. Let's go for 10. Oh, you get me on my off day. Oh, I was going to get there. Unfortunate. I right, bump two. That's huge. One more. Keep it up. Wait, miss, miss. Yes. Let's go. Had to get the 10. Had to get the 10. We take that. Take that and we run. Alright, next game surely is going to be tougher. Surely is going to be tougher. I don't know why that one was as much of a blowout as it was. I don't think those guys are as low ranked as they're saying they are. But they might have been. Who knows? It's like a weird like pearlescentness to these wheels. It looked really nice actually. Kind of like it. Let's get to the next one though, see if we can keep it up and see if we can take down Wieners Incorporated. See if we can do it. Alright, we actually got a sweaty game here. Recognize all these players are not pro players, but they're definitely high up there ranked players. So we'll see. We shall see. The best award here. Spikes on the wall, still full control of the ball. 
Played around two. Bumped the other one. I think you must see a free ball on the wall, which is good. Put all the way back here. Find if he throws that away. Should be easy for one though. One thing I can shoot, but I might be able to fake and bump. There we go. Really tough shot for me to shoot. There's actually no way I could have shot that off my first touch. It was better just to leave it. Make them think I'm going for a shot and then just leave it. Back off, get a bump at the end there. Best thing I could have done in that situation. Good save from them. I right, place it. There we go. It's a good turn there. We're on low boost. We turn middle. We knew Musty could have passed us, and this guy pretty much did what Musty was trying to do anyway. So I was there for it. It wasn't hard to read because that's what I was expecting from Musty, regardless. For the back right boost here. Take the mid. Head to the right side. Found that I died there. They're going to be in a really awkward spot. One of them wasted their boost to kill me. So we take that engagement, I'd say. Be one there. Still have 70 boost, which is good. Play this down right. Musty should get back. Nice good challenge. Wait back wall here. Play forward left. He's gonna have a bang. Gotta be careful because Musty moving forward. Don't want to get too aggressive there. Should be a good opportunity for us. Could even be a goal. Yes. A lot of time there on the double. A lot of space to convert that. Last guy back was in a really awkward spot, right? If they're on the ground, they're like back flipping, still trying to get back. You know you have a lot of time to take the double. All you gotta do is just place it. It's gonna be very tough for them to get out of that situation most of the time. Just fake to the very last second. Wanda was up for that, so honestly I thought he was gonna have it. So I left it for a sec. A fake. There we go. I was gonna fake go down to the ground and then dribble it, but Ended up working out because one that was up. So, again, one of the situations where what I was trying to do anyway ended up working because something else happened. It's a lot of what Rocket League is these days. You expect one thing, but then something else slightly different happens that still ends up working out. And you just take it. I'm not complaining, you know. Fake this. Still have full control. He's forced to waste his boost, throw it away. And then play it back into Musty, so it's going to be an easy ball for him. Way back all here. Should be good for my teammate to follow me. Fine again. It's going to be really easy for, for Wanda, most likely. Can't really see right here, but it's fine. Play patient. Bait in another one. Play a left off the pass. Play it back to me, maybe. I think he went for the shot. I couldn't tell. Maybe it was a pass back that he... Messed up just a little bit. It's a good 50. It goes back to my team. Gives them a chance to pass back to me. Try to follow it up quick. Not the best idea. It was played into them. They're always going to win that ball if they go for it. It's one of those situations you just have to wait. Very tough spot to get out of there. It's a good attempt though. Wait, right side here. Wanda should try to get this right. Come for the back left instead, it looks like. Fake the big touch here. It's going to make them both back off. So now it gives whoever's behind me a free touch. Take my time on this. Try to place it. It's fine. Has to throw it away to my team again. Best case scenario, if you're first man in threes and you don't have the ball, is just try to make them throw the ball away to your team. So Musty's doing here. It's a good idea as well. He didn't get the ball off them, which is the only reason why that was bad, but it was still the right idea, and he did the best he could in the situation, because driving up to them is normally enough, to be honest. That's what you want to be doing as first man, just try to drive up, be annoying, show some presence, make them throw the ball away, make them give your team the ball for free. Gonna have that. It's fine, I had the net blocked. We have full boost back now. Wait, left side. Really got blocked from him. Musty missed, but I could probably follow this up myself. Let him hit that. 
Should be okay. But Tamina? Crazy fake. Big brain. This is huge brain. Oh, flick to me? Hold on. The calculated pro fakes, man. No one ever expects the pro to miss. No one. We're in the corner here. It's gonna come to me. This is the one. My psychic ability is telling me this is the one. All right, I gotta stop saying that. Every time I say it. What? What just happened? <laughs> I guess my uh, my psychic readings were off, but not really. Something crazy did happen. Oh my gosh, what's happened? That was insane, though. I've never had a touch like that, I don't think. In 13,000 hours of playing, I don't think I've seen something like that. It's kind of crazy when you think about it. You'd think I would have seen every every possible touch by now. Every possible pinch. Nope. I haven't seen I haven't seen that right there. That goes straight in. Kinda crazy. Alright. We we took down Wieners Incorporated. Time to take down Noble Scarab. And we're on to the semis if we beat these guys. See if we can do it. Alright, we got ourselves Tino. Some guy with a blank name that I just can't read. Oh, it's upside down H's. For some reason that like Character on Steam just shows up as invisible in Rocket League. And uh, so the guy's name, the original Fire. The touch from us, didn't panic or anything. Must have got the boost there, so we gotta just back off. I'm gonna go for their boost, honestly. Why not? Let's make their uh, side empty here. Not a bad play to make. They're gonna be low on boost for at least the next 10 seconds. Gonna have a full boost here. And the ball to clean up. So the controllers going down to the ground. Should be good for Musty. Follow maybe? Nice. They can't score off this touch right away, so you can just wait. Most of the time it's fine. Fake jump here. To control this. Now we just fit the um. It's fine. Really good pass. Hold on. It's a good play to make back there. So we had a lot of time on the ball. It was really high up. We only had 20 boost though. So if we aerial for that ball, all we're going to do is hit it off the wall, right? Better just stay grounded. You know your teammates are going to be waiting behind you. You know their opponent's going to be waiting for your touch. So it's down to you to make a good play there. We made a pretty good play to get forward. On the amount of boost that we had. Uh, that was a good double attempt. Good idea. Ran out of boost at the end, so we couldn't quite get around it. Definitely the right idea though. Can't go for a double, so I just wait. Go for a bump here instead. Wait, left side if he wants to use me. Good beat there. It's going to be a good opportunity for Musty to get a shot. Super weak. Almost goes in. And that's crazy. Wow. He just pinches it off of... Off of him. Wow. I did not expect that to be the goal that goes in there. But, uh... We take it. We take it and we don't complain. My game's like dropping frames a little bit. I don't know why. Not terrible, but a little bit of a handicap for sure. Just went for the shot there. Would be better play. Trying to just play it over somebody, but nobody jumped. Wasn't worth it. And like pro lobbies, much higher level lobbies, definitely better not to go for a shot there. Everyone's ready for it. But most ranks, you just go for a shot in situations. If you place it well, it's going to be a goal. I just have the habit from pro lobbies to always try to beat people. Hit it over them rather than going for the, the obvious shot. Because obvious shot normally isn't going to go in against most players. Nice. Way left side here. Try to fake them. Fake them again. Hit over two of them. Back to the wall. Play around another. Really good 50s from Wanda. I don't know how how he won either of those. It's crazy. We did well to get around all three there. But 
unreal from one day. You won that 50 and you won another one to get it through. It's crazy. Four goal lead again. We're going crazy this tournament. Got a fake here. Keep full control of the ball. Let him touch this now. Gonna be free. I know my teammate's back wall, so it's honestly just a pass back to my teammate if I let him hit that. I don't mind that situation at all. Forces their boost out and gives us the ball. Go for a bump before I leave here. Killed one. That one's dead, so I go for the third bump. Killed him as well. I have a really good counter opportunity. Keep the ball in. It's really good. Must be in control just now. I see done. Oh, my bad. Didn't see one they're going for that. I should have waited. If I had waited, it would have been fine. If one did wait, it would have been fine. One of us had to make the choice to wait there. Well played, though. So good light touch there. Back to my team. Gets it around the last guy back. He gets pushed up way too aggressively. But they kind of have to be. They're four goals down, obviously. They need a goal. Hit around one. Killed him as well, which is good. Got the boost, waiting to get spot right side if he wants to use me. And he definitely did use me. He used me quite well there. Very good pass. Good vision to have me there. Gonna fake this here. Gonna fake it, go for the dribble. Must he hit though, so I decided to. Maybe try to read his touch at the end. Just fake this. He's gonna pre jump off the ceiling, which is good for us. Pop it over him now. Play middle. One that pre jumped really far forward. Wasn't able to see it until it was a little bit too late. A little pass from Musty. Good idea. I jumped at it just to force the touch out to my team again. Again, effectively works as a pass back. I don't mind that. Save all our boosts in that challenge, which is really good. Go down to the ground, wait for the bounce. Jump for it. We're gonna have a free air dribble. Must can take it. Pre-jump is double down. Oh. Imagine if he missed that and I read it, it would have been crazy. Really good play though. Good patience at the end there. Finish that off. So I get mid-right boost here. Two of them whiffed. Surprising. Fake this. Let him hit it away. I'm gonna fake this again. Make him hit one more time. At least panic to it. Fake again. Should be fine. So I got their whole team to go for that ball. And all it did was waste my position. Because I was the only one that ended up challenging. So baited their whole team in for just that. And it would have been fine. Obviously a little misplay at the end here. We could just chalk it up to trying to get the Brazil. Honestly. Chalk it up to going for the Brazil. Wasn't a mistake. It was all calculated. Crazy that the Brazil thing is like still known, still around from as long ago as it is. Kind of insane. No way, man. <laughs> Again, I'll say it was calculated. I was trying to hit it into him to get scored on there. Even though one of the was trying the own goal, I tried to, I tried to save it. But uh, you guys don't need to know that. It just looks like I passed it. This looks kind of cool too. Rocket boost. I definitely wouldn't use it, but it looks cool. Alright, semi-finals. We don't know who we play yet, but uh, I'll see you guys in the semis. Alright, for the semi-finals, we got ourselves against Fly. Go Rox Go and uh, Calver, I think is how you say that. So let's see how this goes. You guys got to be solid. They made the semis. Definitely not bad. I know Go Rocks Go from a long time ago. I haven't seen him in forever now. Got the RLC season or Rival Series season one challenger tag on. That's like probably 2016, beginning 2017. That was a thing. Good try for Musty. Just chill here for a second. All the way back. Past mid, looks like. Try to play it around them. Oh my. Wait for his touch here. He's in a panic. Uh, almost, almost read him. A good idea. I'm going for the back right boost here. One day is the main chase around, so I'll leave that. It's gonna be a free ball for one day, most likely. 
Totally in a good spot for the, the next pass here. Don't want to overstay on their side. Good passes. Move for Calver here. It's a good read. Notice he misread the touch on the wall there and it's a little bit off the wall. He was trying to catch it. So as soon as I saw that the bounce was bad for him to catch that ball on the wall, I jumped immediately. I didn't hesitate. Because worst case scenario, I'm first man there. If I don't get the touch on that, my second man gets the ball. And it's really just not dangerous at all. So there's no reason not to try to go for that. In my opinion. Very good shot from one. They're very powerful. What can you do if you're the defense there? I'm pretty sure this is the best of one still. I'm not sure if it's best of one or best of three. Might be best of three. I know the finals for sure is best of three. I think it's the best of one there. So we got challenge. Nice. One with the follow. One more touch probably. Try to read this off the corner. Ah. Uh, such a close attempt there. Gonna wait for the bounce. Wait for the second bounce off the ceiling. Don't need to rush this ball. Put it over to baited them both in, which is really good. All because we didn't rush that. You got two baited in. And now we're in a much better position where they're kind of in a spot where they have to rush every single touch here. And they are. Ah. Uh, try to get it over him quick. I rushed him when I didn't need to because he was honestly a lot farther back than I thought he'd be. Pass back to Wanda. Touch forward. Two are on back ball here. One of them's going to miss. Play it down left. Instead of shooting. There was one back ball, one ground. So shooting that was never going to be the, the right play there. They're going to save that every single time. Play around one wall. Good 50. Play left side for Musty touch. Actually a perfect pass for Musty. It was coming through. Saw the vision. Can't shoot that, so I'll leave it. Me and Wanda are rule one on the on the back wall. Oh, it is the best of three. You can see it on the top. So there's like two little little ticks. I don't know if you guys see it or notice it. To the left of uh, the one, to the right of the two. Normally not there. I guess they're going to fill in. So this is the best of three as well. Wait for Musty's touch here. Should be able to play this forward. Nice, I'll just go for this. Why not? It's the worst that can happen. My favorite thing to say is, what's the worst that can happen? Just to see what the worst that can happen is. Play middle. I'm we'll trying to pass. Oh my, I bumped him into bumping my teammate. I don't think that was worth it. Gotta wait for the bounce here. He's gonna go again quick, which is fine. I ended up missing again. Isn't too much of a big deal if I can pass back again. So I control this ball. Made two jump, which is huge actually. Must even get a good hit. Only use six boost on that, which is good. I can still follow up the next if needed. Big challenge here, make him rush this, hit it away to me. Don't have to go for a play an offense there. Fine. Fine again. None of these situations are dangerous quite yet. Here we go. Let's drive into that. Simple challenges are almost always the best ones. Hit back to Musty. Good touch around. You hit off the wall. One is a little pushed up as third there, so it might actually be bad. Be fine. Maybe a shot here from us. One more. The patience from them. Yeah, one is playing really deep third now, which is smart. All I gotta do is bait the touch. Don't have to beat him to that. Beating to is pretty unreasonable uh, there, to be honest. Like to expect to beat him. Ball's coming toward him. Very like favorable spot. I'm not really expecting to get the beat there. This is Rocket League? Nope. It is not. This is Fortnite. Oh. We all, we all suck.
We all suck. It's fine though. We can win the next one, hit our way into the uh, the grand finals, hopefully. Well, my eyes are slowly shutting because I'm on no sleep in the last 30 whatever hours. Let's see if we can do it. All right. Let's see if we can get back to back here. And it's the same squad. They're coming out faster. They seem faster already. Had to be careful there. Actually, really good. He bumped me into the pass. Might work out. Sometimes things just work out, you know. Without much effort. Everything just falls into place. And you can just tell. You know, in like tournament days sometimes, everything's just working. You can just tell. You can do something really dumb and it just works out better than something smart would have. <laughs> but you know. There's another a force outside of everything in the game that's controlling the outcomes. You just gotta let it happen. Go with the flow. I'm just gonna fake challenge here. Make him hit the ball away. Got his boost. Play it back. Be annoying. Be annoying again. Match from one to one more. Play mid now. Play back to me. Can't go for this, but I can challenge now. Just keep it in there. Gonna play it forward. No one's there ready for it, but should be able to get a bang out of this. Play back wall here. Oh, that is such a weak shot. These guys are just shooting so weak. That's crazy. So much time. So much time to get a very fast shot on this, and he takes it like that. Definitely hard to expect that when you're used to playing people that just launch the ball. Maximum speed, top corner. Uh, maybe that's the play though. Maybe I gotta start doing that. Little little lofters. See what he does here. Oh, how is that not a touch middle? I feel like that was on the ceiling. Wow. I don't even know how I reacted in time. All right, sometimes things also don't go your way. <laughs> we hit the crossbar like four times this game, it feels like. Already, it's been half the game. Oh, beat him. Let's watch the demo there. We could do something out of this, potentially. Wow. That was kind of crazy, low key. Went fast to the ball. Fast to this touch. Got a flip, fake the first guy, got under him. Waited to get the perfect, perfect shot. Good bump on one. Got to fake him here. Fake again. Damn, we're going crazy with the fakes right now. Really good first fake. Good second fake there. It makes him have to back off because I have the flip potential during that whole time. Wait for one to here. Pass mid maybe. He wants to use me. Should be fine. Pass left. Let him touch that. It's fine. Move forward here. What one should have. Surely I get a pass across here. I'm just waiting. I'm like a shark. Alright, here it goes. What what is my wow, the server. Wow. Server just exploded. Get a flick over one. Wait for a such here. All they can really do is hit his forward, so it's fine if it goes over me, because look, he's back there. Play it forward. Gotta watch the mid pass. Very dangerous here. So just block him if he goes. If not, then take the, the shot opportunity. Also, every time you get a full boost, try to get in the habit of just saving it. I don't do it sometimes when I'm recording, but in general. 
You want to always try to just save your full boost when you get it. It's going to leave you in a bit, very, very good spot to go for very creative stuff because you have so much in the tank at all times, right? So even off kickoff, get in the habit when you get one, just save it. Full boost. Drive around slowly. You don't need to be going full speed because a lot of times you're just baiting the ball out for your team. Very unfortunate situation because whoever's last back challenged at a bad time. But in general, like you don't have to be going full speed for the ball most of the time. You could just wait. Bait for your teammates. They'll be in a good po they'll be in a good position to do good things a lot of the time, and you'll have full boost whenever you need to go for the ball, and you're up next. Go for this quick, and that's what makes players faster than other players is their boost management a lot of the time. Because if you have a lot of boost, you can just keep going and going and going, and if you have a hundred boost, you can beat people to the ball that have much less than you. It's based off the momentum you'll have going toward the ball. Most of the time, that's the case. So I'm just able to go for both those balls back to back super easily. And it looks like I'm going crazy fast both times, but it's just because I had full boost that entire time, right? We're almost dropping a thousand points here. Didn't even notice. It's a good read. Can't fall out again. I'm gonna waste too much boost on that. So that must go. Should be fine like that. Should be okay here. One more goal for the boys. Ah, oh. waiting for the one to touch to follow it up. All right. Good games again. We're into the finals now. We got two games left to take the dub here. We went crazy that game. Let's see if we can get two back to back at the end here. All right, we got ourselves Bubbly Reaper, Frimsy, and Yor. This is just his name is Yor. I'm gonna fake this first one. Run to the ground, try to get a 50. Excuse the the Steam messages. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I can't control. Sorry. Wow. Just keeps on coming. Really should start going offline when I record. That's unfortunate. Go back right here. Another best of three here. Got the dub. Good fake. Got him off the ball. Big fake here again. Got around one. Got around two potentially. Pretty much. Gonna fake the second guy. A lot of mind games you see me go for these days. A lot of the times when I'm commentating now, you hear me saying I'm about to fake stuff over and over again. Because it's one of the most useful things to do now. Everyone expects the best from you almost all the time and faking is almost always a safer route because worst case scenario it goes right back to your team and that's only a good thing hit around one make him panic a bit touch from musty two of them are for that which is huge for us two he does here Head over to one though Sorry again, I apologize. Faking, faking. There we go. Kind of instilled fear into his eyes. He knew his last back for a long time. Kept the ball grounded, had full control of the situation. All I have to do there is just wait. Wait till the last moment when he inevitably lets me score on him. By panicking a little bit too much. Can keep this one in. I shouldn't fake this one just because I know I can clean beat him to that ball. Better just go for the beat. Fade up in that situation. Wow, that was a really good opportunity actually. I'm not gonna go for this. Everybody up for that. And he's gonna waste all his boost going for the second ball. He actually can't go for it, so my cue to go. Played off the one after Musty. Or Wanda. Actually works quite well as well. Oh, bang that. I'm gonna wait for the bounce here. Try to read it off the bounce. That was actually a good idea. So I faked the set up shot off that. Try to read off the backboard bounce. Would have been really good. Would have been actually super clean. I don't really go for those much like that. Normally just go for the straight up shot, but I decided to go for something different there. Again, yet another incorporation of a fake. Another fake. Fake him again, fake him again. I just put so much pressure on them because they have to be worried about the fact that I could shoot in those scenarios. 
But most of the time, if you do shoot, it's easily savable, right? So it's better not to sometimes. Nice. Play this right side. Try to keep it in. Oh my god. Jesus. That's actually crazy. There's been some insane goals actually in this tourney. Wait for him to jump. So let's get one more around them. Bump the last guy back. Always, if you're going for bumps, guys, target their third man. The third man is the biggest, biggest gap in the team at all times. Creates a lot of pressure and a lot of bad situations for the enemy team if you can kill the third man. So, kill the third man there, and that's all we needed to have an opening. In a very good position there. But just remember those two things. If you're taking anything away from this video and you're trying to get better at threes, when you get a full boost, try to hold on to it as long as you can like this. Hold on. Let the ball come to you in a scenario. You're still full in a good spot. Save your boost on your 50s when you can. And when you're going for demos, try to demo the third man. That's the biggest gap in a defense. You can kill that third man, you're going to help your team get forward and break out of like a very tough situation very easily. Only use your boost when you absolutely need to and try to always be on 100 boost when you're off the ball. That's the best way to think about it. If you keep that in mind, you'll always be in a good position to score. I didn't need to fake that because I honestly could have just scored but I didn't think he'd miss. But it's fine because we're in a really good spot again. Full boost, I can just go back now. Whoever's facing the ball will have a better opportunity to go for this than me. It's fine, don't mind that. Bump them off. The block. Oh my, what a shot. And fake this again. I'm third man, so I don't want to dive full in on that. Fake is really good there, though. The pre jump, very weird, but also very good. Right across here, Musty should see me. Wow, they just missed. Such a hard thing to expect. If you can expect the miss there, if you know when no one's up, obviously it's a free goal. You, easy one to slot home, but the fact that somebody's up there, I have to go pretty quick to it. It's gonna make me take a bad shot, obviously. That's what I mean by the pressure. Like, the fakes cause so much pressure. That guy didn't even go for the ball. He did go for the ball, but he missed, and the fact that he was even up for it caused enough pressure for me to Kind of overthink it a bit and miss, right? <laughs> that I'm missing the empty net. All right, good first game in the finals here. Need one more to get the dub. Let's see if we can close it out here. All right, for last game, same people. We just gotta ice up. Oops, went for the same ball as one. Though. That's fine though. I'm gonna grab the normal pad and I go going back. Get some pads. No way for him to go here. It's fine. Touch doesn't really do much for him. Wait again here. Should be able to bang this. Let's see what happens. You guys are going crazy. Ball's coming to me so I can fake the big hit. Make him back off. They actually didn't back off. So they're, they're becoming immune to my fakes. Kind of crazy. Another double whiff. Only so many situations I can get out before we're going to get... Bumped in one of these spots. Save our boost here. We already used enough. We go for that. Might as well save the rest. Grab two pads. Someone should be back wall. Easy save for whoever it is. Should be fine here. Wait for his touch on the wall. <laughs> Making the panic so hard. I'm not really doing anything. Kind of just staying on the ball when I can. Played around one, one I should have, maybe a double. Tried to read him is a good idea. Nice pass back down, I like the idea a lot. Went on the mid boost here, should come back in a second. Right? There it is, he ended up getting it there. I was keeping track of that one. I figured I'd be on that side of the field around when we come back. 
timing was a little bit off, but I was kind of right. I was as right as I was wrong. Try to wait for the bounce here. Be beyond that, much to hit off the wall. Good idea. I had to place that as much in the corner as I could because of where that guy was blocking. We get try. Very tough shot to get off where that pass is coming from. Don't know what to do with this really. Try to just double mid. I don't have many other options. Touch from Wanda. Oh, my frames are dropping so much right now. Hope you guys don't see it. That would suck if so. Really bad right now. Should be easy for Musty. Actually a really smart fake because he gets full control of the ball now. Off that. Instead of just rushing full speed. Instead of rushing full speed there. Put into a really good spot off of that. Big challenge here, get the ball for free. Go to the ceiling, play it down to myself. I played around this last guy. Get the boost here. Go for a bump or two. Really good touch for Musty. Oh my gosh. What is that fake? That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Didn't do anything. Anything at all. It wasn't really even close to making contact on that. Ended up working out. I'm telling you, man, the fakes are key. Play mid. No way. Okay, I thought he did it again. The calculated whiffs. Ah, I couldn't quite get back. A little bit out of my reach. Also, if you're wondering why I didn't use boost there, I was already full speed. These are my boost, I not really do anything else there. I was just saving it just in case I make the save. I can actually get out of that in a good position. Play it around one more guy. My time here, played over one more. One on the wall should have this. Oh, we're tied up here. I didn't even realize. I thought we were up by one. Gotta focus. Wait for his next touch. Still has some more boost. Leaving it now, looks like. Got a little bit more in the tank, I didn't realize. I did not know how to shoot that. I'm not gonna lie. I was very confused as to if I could shoot it. But uh, I was able to, I guess. Go for some bumps here. Don't even necessarily have to get any when you're going for them. Just going for them alone causes a lot of pressure most of the time. Nice little pass back action there. I got 20 seconds to hold on here. Play the time. Play it around them. Don't need a goal. I'll play it like I would RLCS. Go for this. Don't need a shot again, even though it is kind of open. Probably just go for the time kill. Take another one here. Take another one here. Take another one. No reason to play the ball into them over and over again when we have full control in all these situations. And there you go. So the mind games are so deep, they ended up just slamming into their own net. They couldn't take it anymore. All right. Good games all around. Fun tourney. Well played. The one that in the musty. Gotta thank Musty for the invite, because he always invites me to these tourneys. Although I'm busy most of the time when he asked me, I wasn't today, and we're able to get this, this video out. Even though I'm very tired, I'm on no sleep at all, but I'm glad you guys stuck with me all the way to this point. If you guys did. And uh, yeah, another tourney dub in the books. We got ourselves the Season 3 Supersonic Legend tourney winner title. Hell yeah. Good vibes. And all these points as well. GG's. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed. Have yourself a wonderful day or night. Whatever time it is when you guys are watching this, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I love you. Peace.